All right, this is my vinyl wall for the month of October. Now, the theme I went with was women in R&B, and I wanted to do current, and you know, I didn't want to go like too far back. So you got Jasmine Sullivan, you got her, you got SZA, Summer Walker, you got Solange, you got my baby Ari Lennox, Victoria Monet, Fauna Hughes, Jamila Woods, Leon La Havis, Snow Allegra, and Yuna. But that's the wall for the month of October. So women in R&B, they killing it right now. So why not highlight them? I'm going to do something different. So normally we talk about the importance of owning physical media. We are talking about vinyls. We're talking about CDs. We're talking about cassettes. We're talking about DVDs, you know, that type of stuff. And that is very important. But I want to highlight some books and, and magazines that I own. So I want to highlight a couple of, of magazines and books. Um, Lucky Seven. Um, I got this from somebody on this app. It's a creator on this app. I think her name is Nia. If I could find the card, I'll put the card in. Um, but this is a magazine. She did all this. You know, this had to be so difficult to get done. I'm trying to show you all some pictures. And she also has this one that I bought. It has navy blue on the cover. And then... Kari Fox on the back, you know what I'm saying? Um, I guess, yeah. But I think that this is dope. It has like interviews, pictures, all that stuff that you get in a magazine, you know? Check her out, check the magazine out. I think it's dope. I'm trying to get more magazines. First things first, um, this one is about women in hip hop. You know, you can't tell the story of hip hop without having women included in here. You can get this book anywhere that they have books. I got it from Barnes & Noble because there's one literally by my house. You can get off Amazon. You can get it probably from any local bookstore. Like, honestly, if you can get it from a local bookstore, I recommend you do that. I'd rather support them than somebody like a Barnes & Noble, personally. But um, there was a Barnes & Noble by my house. Um, I wanted a book. I'm impatient, so I bought it from there. It's about women in hip-hop. Check it out, you know. Um... Yeah. Dilla time about the life of Jay Dilla. Everybody has this book. <laughs> Everybody who loves hip hop has this book. I love Jay Dilla. I think he's one of the greatest, not just producers, just artists who ever live. Big fan of his. He also has a documentary that I watched on Hulu that made a young thug shed a tear. Check out Dilla time. You know, you can also get this <laughs> wherever you get books. Um, I think I I think I got this in Seattle. If I did get it, no, I got it in Portland from Powell's Books. So you can get it anywhere though. It's everywhere. Swabbing niggas banging, niggas slanging down here. I got cheese holes and a bunch of fucking dope. I got peas, coke, and some killers at the door. Hydro weed, smoke, and a quota I'm some dope. What you need, bro, is to fuck it with your boy. see what it is so it's esperanza spalding this is her debut album i didn't hear her until robert glasper's uh black radio three that's my introduction to her i know she won the grammy over drake and all that type of stuff but i didn't hear her until i heard black radio three and then i went back and listened to her music my gosh my gosh i see why she won the grammy over drake but this is the album so we about to listen to this in a little bit. Mm -hmm. 